Hey, what's going on guys? It's Chaos here, and I'm recording another video, so I know I haven't really been uploading at all recently, but um, I'm gonna try and upload more often. Um, I've just been busy lately, and I haven't been able to get a video out. Um, so yeah, um, this is gonna be a quick little video on how to make a tool that allows you to earn money, so I'm just going to Put a script in the set of scripts that this thing is going to write. So we just got scripts in this now. Real player added events. So our player is added. At, um, uh, here inside of the player. So this is literally just a quick way to set script that when you join, um, you have um, like a leaderboard in the top right uh, that's like built into the player list. Should not do that, but that's pretty simple. Um, that's not what the video is about though. So basically, you're gonna want to insert a uh, tool. So I'm going to go ahead and put a tool into the workspace now uh, while we edit it. And inside, I'm just gonna name this. Um, let's get the tool. Um, I'm going to put a script in here. Or, yeah, I'll, I'll just do a script. Um, do a script, and I'm going to put a local script in there. And I'm going to put a remote event. And I'm going to put a part inside of here and name this handle. Uh, I don't really want anything. Okay. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and resize this real quick. Oh boy, I don't really use this very much. I'm just going to leave it like that. And make sure this is not anchored because we don't need So I'm going to go ahead and put this inside of the starter pack. And the first thing you're going to want to do, I'm going to just quickly name this. Uh, this is the client script, and this is the um, server script. And then I'm just going to rename this uh, to event. Alright, let me just type in the ball there, geez. Alright. Um, Alright, so we're gonna go local uh, equals game dot player game colon get service uh, players. Okay. And local client equals uh, players dot local player. And then the tool equals script dot client. And then local event equals tool for with the child um, event. Alright. <clears throat> so, when the, so basically how you make a click event happen. So when a player clicks on the screen, um, while the tool is active, um, so we'll do tool that equipped um, connect function. And then it's like there tool dot oh sorry, uh, we'll do a debounce, so local debounce uh, equals false and tool dot activated from that function. And so when the tool is equipped, oh it uh, creates a variable called debounce and it sets it to false. Um and when the player clicks, it fires the activated event. So, what we'll do is if not debounce, so if debounce is equal to false, then 
Now we'll set debounce to true. Uh, so while it's running through this code, the player cannot click again until debounce is set to false again. So, yeah. Um, we're going to fire an event. So event colon uh, fire server. And what we'll do is I'll do um, we'll do a random event. So I'll do accept the random seed to os.com. So this basically just makes uh, makes math.random just completely random. So we'll just go ahead and do a local. Well, actually, just send it off. But normally, I just make a variable and call it like local pay or local reward or something. Yeah. So we'll just do math.random, and we'll do it between I don't know, 16 and 32. And <clears throat> we'll do a wait. Uh, we'll do wait 0.5 seconds, and then the balance will be set to false again. So that is the client script right there. Um, that's all that you need for the client. Um, obviously, you can add things to it. I would suggest all adding some, like other stuff to this, but this is just how to basically give you some coins or some kind of stat when you click on the screen while tools click. Um, so we can go ahead and copy the code here, these points four and five with tool and event. Uh, we'll paste it into the server here. <coughs> so event dot on server event on connect functionality. Um, and it automatically sends off the player and this will be Um, so, we'll do local uh, coins equals PR dot leader snaps dot coins, and then we'll do coins dot value, which is coins dot value plus reward. And now, if you were to go in, you'll have a tool. So you have a tool, it's literally just a brick. And every time you click, as I pull it, you notice how I'm repeatedly clicking and it's not going up uh, very quickly because I have that uh, wait time there so that, you know, players can't auto-click. And obviously I'm not going to be using this for any kind of game, but it's always something good to have. You don't want players to be able to auto click and and you know have at different um, <laughs> want to be able to auto. I mean, obviously players will still auto click, but it will prevent players from being able to earn fast by auto clicking. If you think it's important, but yeah. So hopefully you found this video helpful. Um, I will be trying to post more often. Um, uh, just give me some video ideas, and I did see that comment about uh, ripple effect. I, I'll work on that sometime soon, hopefully. Um, just gotta update the video and uh, smooth some things out, and my editor and get it up on YouTube. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Found it helpful, and I'll see you guys in the next one.